such a bore when faced with yet another whore to think of a new method to dispatch her. So when I'm feeling grand, I change my modus operandi. And, and in, in that, that way, no one will ever catch ya. When you've covered all the angles from poisoning to strangles, and you haven't yet been dragged into the dock, it's always much more thrilling to be inventive with your killing. But if they catch you, you could get a nasty shock. <laughs> Instead of trying to restrict him, take a trophy from your victim. A clipping of the pubic hairs is good. And if you want to cause a ripple, make a belt from ladies' nipples. And wear it as you dance round in the woods. is tripping at the thought of yet more ripping and your hands they might be slipping from the neck that they are gripping and the acid it is dripping from the body you are dipping and your trusty spade is flipping all the bodies you are tipping and while you amass your clippings of DeSalvo Hagen Crippen Christy? Sorry. Take some advice from one killer to another there's always someone worse than you. In your case, it's your mother. David? Have you done it yet? I'm sick of looking at all those royals. The Queen Mum looks more like John McEnroe. <laughs>